Hello people, it's MX5 Gaz, he's back. I know it's been a while or so, it's been over a month. Uh, but I've been waiting some for some uh, some stuff to come, but it's not arrived yet, so we have to do another video. And the other video, I'm really excited about this. Now, for those of you that know a bit about motorsport, this won't come as any surprise to you. Um, but honestly, this is absolutely gobsmacking. So, um, the MX-5 is on a diet. Um, that what that does then I'm looking down here but what that does then is that frees me up from not having to go on a diet so um, what I've bought is I'm going to open the box is this lithium power light um, battery now this is the box I've already opened it so I'm going to play like I'm surprised so go along with that bit but there's the first in honestly this is unbelievable right okay so Let's open the box and look, no scissors. I've got a grown up all ready to cut the cellar tape open. Oh, I'm already on board with this. A sticker, superb. Um, bought this as well, by the way, from a company called Hawk Motorsport that I'm obviously, as you know, I'm not affiliated to anyone really, um, but I'm easy bought. Um, no, uh, I bought this from uh, Hawk Motorsport. I think they're down in Southampton. Brilliant service, really helpful. They're on Facebook, um, or you can, you know, go on the interweb and that sort of stuff and maybe find them that way. So in the box, what do you get? Sticker, some instructions, not in um, Japanese, so we've got every chance with this, haven't we? Uh, oh, look at this, key ring, love it. So loads of goodies, no sweets, but hey oh, you can't have it all. And the first thing that this pack comes with is um, it comes already with its own charger because you can't use a standard um, lead acid charger so it comes with a charger now cost okay yes it's a, a, a lot dear well when you say a lot dear i suppose you know that that's all relative isn't it it's a it's a little bit dearer than a standard battery but if you was going to get you know say an alfred's battery you might pay i think i paid about 80 quid for mine a, a, a couple of years ago or whatever um you know, you're probably looking at around about a, a bit more than that. But don't forget that it comes with a charger as well. And the weight that you're going to save is is pretty phenomenal. Anyway, so um, it also comes... So this is the battery. Look at look at that. It also comes with... I really like this. Um, I'm not going to take it off for the minute. Um, it, it, it comes in its own little um, bracket. The, oh, there we go. It comes in its own with its own little bracket, so you can so you don't need any fittings or anything. Now look at this. This isn't me liking about. Look at that. Honestly, I'm gonna weigh it in a minute. But you know, I've been into vehicles all my life. Really, this is lighter than than when I used to be into motorbikes. A motorbike battery. I can't believe it. Literally, I can't believe how light and small this is. Look at that. You know, and as you know, I'm no strapping lad. I've got the bulks in the wrong places. But look, look, honestly, look at it. Unbelievable, unbelievable. It also has a little thing on the top there um, that tells you um, how much volts you've got in and such forth. The only thing with this is that you can use it every day. However, if you're going to let your car stand for several days, then this might not be the battery for you as well because what you're not supposed to do with these or don't do it, not, not supposed to, don't do it, is don't let these run flat because they're, de they're deemed um, useless if you do. But it's lithium, li uh, lith 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 it's that new battery, that new type of battery uh, that are in cars and, you know, um, iPhone, all that sort of stuff. But look at the technology. Now, quick comparison. Now, I'm not liking about with this. Jesus, I can hardly lift this up. This is just, this has come out of my car, obviously. This is um, standard Alphard's battery. I've had this. And, uh, it, oh, honestly, I can't believe it. Uh, look at the size as well. It's like, it, uh, you can't believe that that's a battery. I, honest, I'm gobsmacked. Um, and like I said, I know the motorsport viewers amongst us will be like boring or whatever. But, you know, like, like me, Edin says, I'm just a bloke discovering whatever I can. And I think that this is a big discovery. Um, right, so... Okay, so... That's what's in the box. Honestly, 
can't believe it. Look at that. Right, so that's what's in the box. So um, for those of you of a technical spec, um, it's the same, is it um, AH or, or whatever it is in regards to that 45. Um, the only difference with this is it won't hold its charge for as long as what that would. So if you're using your car every day, um, certainly what I'm going to be using it for is on track days and on sprints as well, because I'm going to save an absolute bucket load of weight. So it means I can, I can join the queue in the burger van at lunchtime. Right, so enough of me. Let's do the science bit now. And let's um, weigh these and let's give you the, the actual um, figure on what the advantage will be. Okay, so let's, um, let's get the scale. Right, so first of all, standard battery. Let's give this a lift up. Jesus. There we are. Oh, blimey. 12.45 um, kilograms. Turn this one upside down for a minute um, just to get the, the hook on the thing. So, look at that. 1.4 kilogram. 1.4 kilogram. Unbelievable. And actually, just while I disconnect this, while I am on this subject, um, the instructions do say that you can mount this any way you want, sideways, upside down, you know, however you want to do it. So, yeah, so... There we go, well chuffed with that. If I just put it, sorry, it was a bit out of sort of scope there. There we are, look at that. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to uh, whap uh, the new one into the car so I can just listen to it fire up, see if it struggles or whatever. Um, so let's get down to the garage. Right, here we go, cold start. Ignition on. Fire her up. Yeah, no problem. No problem at all. Obviously, it's searching for a tick over because the battery's been off, but just reach down there. There we go. Yep. Voltmeter, a little bit low, but um, it is on a cold start, and it's the first time I've I've used it. So, yeah, more than happy with that. Excellent. So, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. Hopefully, it won't be as long, because um, hopefully we've got some good stuff coming up. Stay safe. Take care. Like, subscribe, comment, and all that sort of stuff.